Rev up those mugs of tea. Because it's time for... Chivalry. Of the bug... Of the bug kind. I don't know. Hollow Knight! Gonna rejigger my thingies here. After our extremely successful battle against the Watcher Knights, need to reassess. I really like being able to move quickly around while I explore, so keeping that. And let's try out Steady Body. Because I don't like how every time you attack it pushes you backwards when you hit something. Hello Alice, chivalry and tea is all anyone could ask for. We are truly living in a golden age. So where to? We've got two dreamers left, and then the door to the black egg will open, presumably. Clearing the way to the Hollow Knight. The titular Hollow Knight. We haven't actually... One of the Watchers is... In the area that I don't have a map for. And I can't remember what it's called because it's not on the map. And as we have established, if it's not on the map, I can't see it. So... I guess we're gonna go to Deep Nest. I guess... What's the quickest way to get there? It looks like we should be able to travel from Ancient Basin to Deep Nest. I don't want to risk it because that's a long way to go for a hunch. But then again there is a tram bug down there. Oh and we can talk to the... We can try and activate the king again although I imagine that's gonna be like a... Only if you've collected every single every single uh, dream nail thingy and I just give me a second I need to warm up don't judge me yesterday was I think an amazing performance by anyone's estimation so just give me a second to get back into the groove of things I don't think that's too much to ask I like being able to move fast. Moving fast is good. Makes me feel like I'm progressing even if I'm not really going anywhere. Like that. Oh wow. It is exactly like a... Like, I, I completely lack object permanence. Like, I'm a, I'm a baby playing peekaboo. No, you're not getting off that easy. This is a no mercy stream. We're not letting enemies run away. Don't start what you can't finish. I'm talking to you, Rhino Roy. I'm gonna let that guy go though, because he was cute. Okay, so here's the tramway. Uh. Okay. This is new. And disgusting. Oh, 
Not cat or baby playing peekaboo. I mean, they're both. They're, they're both applicable. However, thank you for going for the less demeaning one. I just went ahead and took that liberty for myself. Do not be fooled, that is not a cute bug. That is something else. Oh dear. No, you currently exist because the chat is always in my peripheral vision. Oh fuck, we don't have any, um... We don't have any goo. I can't break through the floor. Need to beat something up. Oh dear, this isn't good. I mean, you exist to me. I can't speak for the grand scheme of the universe, but... I'll stop. I'll shut up. Hello. Ooh! Yes! Now, I wasn't paying attention <laughs> when we were at the blacksmith last time, but I assume we're gonna need more than one pale ore to level up the nail again. Zack! Thank you for joining us. Zakos lives. I appreciate your presence. Each level up costs one more ore incrementally. Yeah, I figured. Uh, I should have figured that those things explode when you kill them. So that's one. And yes, unfortunately, Pale Ore is becoming quite rare. I mean, I knew it wasn't going to be falling from trees. Oh my god, I didn't... I spent all my white goo again. Jesus Christ. Okay, come on. We need to, we need to charge up here. Oh, screw it. Screw it. Please don't die! That'll be enough. Uh, this won't be, though. Oh, bad at video games. <coughs> oh! Man, we really should have rested somewhere. It's fine. I've got my speedy. I've got my speedy boots on. How am I doing today? I am good. I'm quite tired. Because uh, being this bad at video games is actually quite tiring. Very, very tiring. Very tiring. I'm just not even paying attention. Let's just... It's, it's fine. It's, we're warming up. It's good. But no. Um, I didn't get a lot of sleep last night because there was some kind of fucking hurricane outside. I don't know what the weather was doing. Uh, someone told me it was wind. So I guess I do know what it was doing. It was windy, but it was very windy, and this house doesn't deal well with anything above a mild breeze, and the place was shaking like fuck. And I had a weird dream about being stuck in some kind of cupheadish reality. 
which wasn't as fun as you would think. And I'm just gonna try not to die! And then of course I had a full day at work as well. So, yeah, pretty sleepy. So if I suck today, more than usual I mean, I'm just gonna blame that on being tired. Is my household? No. <laughs> I mean, it's not new, but it's not, it's definitely not old. I really need to just get better at video games. Uh, where did we... This was where we were. Oh, I hear a cute bug! Please don't be a mimic. I'll be sad. I didn't have a cup for a head. Okay, I've got the wi- Okay, no, I think- I think this is real. Yes! I don't- I'm sure there's gotta be- I'm- I'm- <laughs> I'm thinking this is like a- a Dark Souls mimic situation where you can tell the fake ones from the real ones, but I just don't know what the tell is. I need to I need to closely examine every cute bug I find. Nope, right into that one. Uh, let me in, you son of a bitch. I hear something breathing. Oh, hello. Oh! Hey! I can't remember what voice I gave her. My friend, you dealt with all of those beasts? I'm ashamed to say I was hiding. Those ghastly things chased me and I ran. If you hadn't come along, who knows if I'd ever have survived. Others take me for a fearsome warrior, what with my impressive size, but this kingdom's beasts, I wonder if I'm just no match for them. Ha -ha! Whoa. Bakusa. Enough! I cannot wallow in my weakness. I must take strength from your example. You act so confident in battle. You show no fear before your foes. I'll try my best to do the same. Wow, how inspiring. I look forward to our next contact, tiny saviour. Then you'll meet a warrior with courage to match your own. Oh, please don't make me fight you. Das Manut. Das Manut. How, how do we get through here? This is very upsetting. Shit. Uh, well, to the... <laughs> don't forget to dream now. Thank you! Such luck! This tiny one appears at just the right moment, and what masterful skill it shows! As a warrior, it sets powerful precedent. I do well to learn from its form. Do they have... Yeah. Thank you for reminding me to do that. I... That is a mechanic of this game that I completely forget exists. She looks up to me, which is funny because I'm so tiny. I forget where that actually goes. Where does this tram take us? Wait a minute. Am I just a fucking idiot? I mean, yes, but... Because surely... Th Hang on. Wait.
Have I seriously not been here before? I must have been. If you break the music players in the tram, it stays broke permanently for the rest of the game. Oh man, gotta be careful. I like that little weird version of the save music. What is happening? Where am I? Did I seriously not ride the tram? This is ridiculous. Oops. Cool. There's some kind of hive. This is not where I was planning to go, but I'll roll with it. Anything new is cool in my books. Please don't fall. Please! No, not the bears! They're in my eyes! My eyes! Ah. Prime cage. These are... We've got the buzzing. I mean, we're definitely in the hive kind of aesthetic here. I get the feeling they're lulling me into a false sense of security with these one-hit kill enemies. Cornifer! Kingdom's Edge. Oh no. What's going on here? Jumpies. Where is Cornifer? Fantastic movie. I love when he punches the lady in the bear costume. Yes. Yes! What is happening here? Oh, I thought that was a platform. Shit! Are people... Are these bugs falling? Cornifer, what's happening? What's happening to them? Can't lose. This music's not giving me good feelings. Champion. Where are you? Did I go past him? <laughs> Whatever. Thank you. Isn't this a cozy hole? I've been venturing about the wilderness beside here and thought a moment's break was well called for. The landscape's all rather serene this side of the city. Though the inhabitants are as ferocious as ever. Give me that map. <laughs> Judging by this wall, the city's folk seemed hesitant to build further into these caverns. I wonder what kept them at bay. Uh oh. <laughs> and what are you thinking? <laughs> to chart the world, what joy. If only a Zelda could share the thrill. <laughs> Bafanada. Colosseum of Fools. There's a bench over there. Ooh! Was, is this the Colosseum that the guy was... There was a guy trying to find the Colosseum, right? 
Yeah, now the place is real to me. We have... <laughs> Until this moment, I was just walking around in a dreamscape. But I want to I wanna bench before I go any further. Even though we did climb up a long way, but never mind. Oof. Ugh. Stop! I miss the charm that gives me extra goo. That was a nice one. <laughs> Cartography definitely does nada for her buffer. So Hallow Nest didn't stretch this far because of some horror, like some terrible thing. I'm seeing a lot of ash. Or feathers. Give me the fucking bench, please. Please! Oh, and there's a further to the left as well. Hi. Wait a minute. Isn't this the painter guy, or is this a different one? How did you find me down here where the world ends? Yes, I know where you're here. You came to learn a nail art from the legendary nail master, Oru. It is the law of the great nail sage that I must pass down my teachings to those who are worthy. But no law forbids me from exacting a payment for my time. If you truly wish to train under me, prove it with Geo. Okie dokie. Oh yeah! Spar with me, senpai. The dash slash. Slash while dashing to perform the dash slash. I must say you're an excellent pupil. Your skill with the nail and your thirst to become stronger. You remind me of my brothers. I have taught you all I can. Go back into the world, traveler, and leave me to my solitude. Bam. Finn. Yes. Bow. But now what do you really think? Brother Matu, in your lonely home at the top of the world, do you still think of me as an enemy? In the future, if you will listen, I will tell you why I chose to tread this path. I wonder how many nail sages there are, or nail whatever, training guys. Yeah, I guess they're brothers or something. So, charge. That's cool. Who's this? Is this like a training dummy? Oh, Jesus. Stop! Oh no. Oh man, he did an extra long jump! I thought he was stuck on the ceiling. 
<laughs> no bully. But it didn't fight back! You could dream nail the dummy. Yeah, I was, I was gonna try. Stronger brothers. Oh dear, that has unpleasant implications. Just beat up this corpse. Nothing special. Well. Even deeper into the Earth's core, why not? What is the purpose of this? Oh, even further down, I see. Jesus Christ. Just when you think I couldn't possibly get any worse. I'm kind of overdoing the whole bad at video games thing, aren't I? But I mean, Jesus, I really get hit by a lot of projectiles. I'm like, I walk right into them. It's embarrassing. Oh, this is good. Yeah, I like this. So you think he's stuck. But as soon as I go over and exploit that, he's gonna jump out. Or maybe I just cheesed it. And that's fine too, because he probably would have killed me. Okay, how about that? Okay, I see what you I see what you're saying. Try this one on for size. Okay, I understand that, but I've also got this. And this. Most importantly, <laughs> I've got one of these. <sighs> That's just embarrassing. It is a big cavern. Oh my jeez. Uh, ah. No, we're not going to have another repeat of Monday. I will never allow that to happen again. Hello. Rancid egg. Maybe the hunter's notes will give us some insight into the rancid eggs, because I've forgotten actually what they do. Placid but putrid creature holds rancid eggs within its gut. Easily tracked down if you have a sense of smell. If you find one of its eggs, I strongly suggest you do not eat it. Wow! Great advice. See, all I needed was that stress. Stress can do wonderful things. You bug? Oh, 
I think this is a regular cute bug. Yes! Cute bug! Absolutely worth the deaths. This could be a problem. This is definitely going to be a problem. Oh no! I didn't- Oh no! I didn't get my Geo back. Oh, this is bad. Okay. Stress! Carry me! Stress! Lots of stress! Shit! How much Geo did I lose? The good thing is, I didn't notice how much Geo I lost. I don't want to know, actually. Don't tell me. You can pay Rancid to the guy at the right end of the starter village to so Oh yes, I remember now. So, I could have used the Rancid eggs to avoid what just happened. Gotcha. There are also other uses, but not spoiling it. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, I don't think I had too much Geo. And I can always I can always make it back. Ah. See, that time, no problems. Oh, that is a bad strategy. Don't you fucking dare! Really? Get the fuck out. Wow, relentless! Howdy. After I complete this game, I'm going to watch a speedrun and get really depressed. Quick slash. That is surely a good one. Three notches. Born from imperfect discarded nails that have fused together. The nails still long to be wielded. Allows the bearer to slash much more rapidly with their nail. That is awesome. That is absolutely worth all of the work it took to get here. Especially since I'm going to die as soon as I step foot back in this room. Little bees! Have mercy. The current record speed run is at 41 minutes. Oh! <laughs> Let 
Meanwhile, I think we're currently clocking in at like... 16 hours. <laughs> I mean, I know there's a lot of difference between a speedrun and a blind run, but still. Ouch. I bet they didn't have half as much fun as we're having. I bet they had a different kind of fun. But yes. We are having a whale of a time, and that's all that matters. Uh, Zach, am I correct in thinking that uh, it's you that's been posting comments on the YouTube uploads of these? Like, giving me tips and stuff? There you go. Just make all, all that Geo back. We never lost anything. Yeah, I thought so. Thank you for those. I appreciated the feedback. <laughs> the Inferno Cop Avatar, yeah. A stressful kind of fun. I prefer wandering around, taking all in, and enjoying the ride. <laughs> Me too. I don't think I have the, uh, the constitution for speedrunning. I mean, there's a lot of practice involved. I'm just getting confused here. Um, yeah. So this is... We've been here before. This is where we came from. See, it's not on the map, so I don't know what's happening. What is your purpose? Explore every every possible pathway, even if it's filled with enemies. Need to remember to do that. I wonder if I have enough charms to unlock the next notch. I hear a cute bug! But do I? They breathe in, and they breathe out two times, and they look sad. The spiral on the top of the jar is facing forwards, and it is a real cute bug! Yes! Did I try the dash nail art I got? Yes. I haven't tried it on an enemy yet. It's pretty cool. I don't see myself using that on an actual enemy, to be fair. It requires too much <laughs> forward planning. I'm pretty much operating purely on reflex. Hence the terribleness. And we freed like three cute bugs. And I've only taken a sip from my tea once.
verging on lukewarm. Oh yeah, I could just... <laughs> That's the equivalent of like getting hit by a car while you're looking at your smartphone. Oh, I don't know. I've looped back around on myself in the same life so many times, I don't know where I've visited that hasn't been marked. I don't think I've been here yet. You could try dream nailing the cute bugs. Oh shit! That is a good idea. Oh, it's like a... Oh, this is sad. It's like the Dyatlov Pass incident up here. Being too comfy to make more tea is one of the biggest conundrums in life. <gasps> Whoa! What the fuck? What's she doing down here? I thought this was like an optional place. Don't make me kill you. Oh, don't make me kill you! So you'd pursue the deeper truth? It isn't one the weak could bear. Have you ever heard the tale of Darth Plagueis the Wise? It's not a story the Jedi would tell you. Don't do this! Prove yourself ready to face it. I'll not hold back. My needle is lethal and I'd feel no sadness in a weakling's demise. You bitch! Show me you can accept this kingdom's past and claim responsibility for its future. I'm just playing a video game! Oh my god, she like, shielded. Look at her defending. Ooh. Yeah, she is parrying my shit. Oh, that move keeps me off guard every time. Quick, quick, quick! Aha. Nope. Laugh too soon. Nope. What? What? Oh, she parried the fuck out of me. Okay. We are not specced for this. I want quick slash. And... I don't want to make this too one-sided. Um, otherwise I'd use like poison and stuff. I'll keep steady body. So how much quicker does that make? Oh shit! You better believe we're keeping that. God, look how much slower we are without the speedy charms on. I'm not putting my bare feet on the cold, cold ground if I can help it. Amen. Can I just say, I really appreciate it when games have this mechanic. When there's like a, a... A boss character that's... Very similar to you. Like a rival. That you have to fight over the course of the game. A few times. Like, um, I don't know if anyone's ever played... Sparkster. Rocket Knight Adventures. That game had a similar kind of thing. 
I know many games have had a similar kind of thing, but I just, I really like it. This is not going well. Please don't stab. That went way worse than last time. Those bugs don't look as messed up and in such a state of distress when they went down as those guys in that incident you mentioned. Well, no. Yeah, I think it originates from the Mega Man games where you fight Proto Man. Yeah. That kind of thing. I've only ever played the very first Mega Man. Shame me. Charge right into it. Knock him away. But she just immediately redoes it. Okay. She like caught me in the air, damn. Since you only really can get one, two hits in at once, charge hit should work better. Yeah, I was thinking that the uh, this wasn't working out as well as I thought. Maybe on regular enemies, but for quick bosses, it's not really working out, is it? We're not gonna need Gathering Swarm or Wayward Compass for that matter, so let's go. I've never tried this. I've never tried either of these. Uh, that one is actually... Let's try that. Quick focus would be good too, yeah. Can you hit her with those stars? I don't think you could. Because I'm pretty sure I hit her with one of them and it didn't do any damage. I don't know what Dream Shield does. Let's. I'm going to experiment with Dream Shield. And yeah, I'm going to use Quick Focus. That's a good shout. Woo! No. <laughs> that is too random to be helpful. We'll go for... I get the feeling she's going to be hitting me a lot. Let's give that a shot. It blocks projectiles, yeah, so the odds of that catching her needle in the air is not great.
Okay, this is gonna have to be the fight where I learn how to use this charge attack properly. I tried to use the charge dash thing. <laughs> ah. Come on, enter my web. Damn it. She's too smart for that. Parry that! Ow! Unsurprisingly, that <laughs> did not go well. Oh, we did better than last time. I'm not used to using the charge attacks. I'm using twice as much thumb. I don't know if you noticed that certain charms can be comboed. How so? Absolutely wrecking me. I need to learn how to use this fucking mechanic effectively. Nice of my soul to wait outside the boss room. At least he's polite. I did try and dodge that one at least. Give me a fucking break, man. Jesus. Try Defender Crest and Spore Shroom. Oh, is that gonna like poop up my poison. I really hate smelling like poo. I have to be honest, like this is 
not ideal. This isn't the most heroic way I'd want to win this fight. Plus, I didn't even get a chance to heal in that last fight, so... This charge attack is not working out for me. It's making me take a lot more hits than I would if I was playing normally. But I do need to learn how to use it, so I guess I'm just gonna keep... Keep at it. Each death brings me closer to my eventual victory. I'm not even stunning her anymore. Yep, cool. <clears throat> I'm not even getting a chance to heal. That's the British stiff upper lip thing I hear so much about. Yes! I only give up when there's nobody watching. Fucking break. Okay, so yeah. Extremely poopy cloud when I heal. She's not even getting stunned anymore. Okay, there we go. I don't have any fucking goo left. No! 
No. Okay, so, yeah. I guess that makes the poison more powerful. Um... I don't know. Let me let me rejigger this. I'm not really feeling this. I like healing quick. I like the shell and I like the spore shroom. Spam spells with charms that give you more spell power. That's an interesting idea. So if I fuck this one up, which I will, then I'll I'll do it. I'm up for anything at this point. She get off having so much health. Like it's not fair. <laughs> Make this a fair fight, Hornet. So, how about that powerful spells technique? Improves the bearer's ability to cast spells. Map, geo, shell, soul catcher. Speed, speed, getting attacked. No, no. No, 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 no. Allows the bearer to uh, collect more soul when striking foes. Uh, that's the only charm I have that uh, affects my spells, so... I don't know about that. Plus, any th like, no heal run and me. Those two things don't really go together very well. Yeah, I think I have all the soul gain ones on as well now. That I own. And... I don't know. Doesn't really matter. Let's get there quicker so we can die faster. Going in here with some soul would have been a good shout too.
<coughs> Seriously! Well, that certainly staggered her faster. I'm open to trying that a couple more times. Honestly, I just want to do this without charge attacks. Just dodge and get the hit in when I know I'm safe. Charging up the attack just completely fucks up my rhythm. What little there is to fuck up. Yep, nice. Oh, f you know, fucking Christ. Oh, just kill me for fuck's sake already. Really. That did not go well. Uh, but I think it's the way that's working the best. Yeah, desolate diving when she's under me. That worked out pretty good too. try this I want to try this the classic way I'm not really I'm not really feeling any of this One good trick is to nail jump on her while she's doing her sting shot, followed by a desolate dive. Doing it multiple times should take off shock for health, pull easily without you taking damage. What? What's the sting shot? I mean, it sounds good, but I don't know what the moves are called. This is going much worse than anything ever.
Oh. I really wish you could start healing when you're sliding down walls. It's the Hegali Adilum, <laughs> where she throws it horizontally and pulls it back. Okay, that is very specific, thank you. Hegali Adilum! I'm going to be hearing this in my dreams. What oh, nightmares. Cool. I just walk right into her. Knows where I'm gonna go. Seriously, she's predicting my movements now, and I just charge right into her, and that's it. That's the end. Ugh, this is tough. I also think this is the only boss in the game that doesn't let you damage her when the fight starts. Yeah. You can get one off on her like really quick as she jumps back, but... You fucking bug! <laughs> Bouncing on her after that works pretty well too. Give me a break. Got impatient there. Shit. Quick. Quick. Shit. 
Yeah! Whew. Sorry, I didn't talk much during that. I was concentrating. Please tell me the fight's over. So strong. <laughs> you only had to die five fucking million times. You could do it if you had the will. But could you raise your nail once knowing its tragic conception? And knowing yourself? Then do it, ghost of Hallownest. Head onward. Burn that mark upon your shell and claim yourself as king. Holy fuck! I really should have used the dream nail on her while she was standing there, shouldn't I? Like, I don't want to do anything drastic. I'm just a bug! Oh, okay. We can go in here. Cast off shell. This is nice. Marked by King's Brand, Hallowness shall recognize a new ruler. The kingdom's gates will open. I'm the king! And yes, you did say I was the king! Oh fuck, let's get out of here. Yep. Um. Oh! Thanks, Hornet. Dream Nail does no actual damage, by the way. No fear in using it. Thank you, because I was worried. <laughs> you know, hitting things- hitting people with a sword generally entails you're gonna be hurting them in some manner, but as long as it is just reading, reading their thoughts, then I'm good. All hail the king, baby. I, I guess I'm the king now. I wasn't planning on that, but there we go. So what doors did I need to open? This is good actually, because if I'd gone after one of the dreamers and been hit with a door that I had no way of opening, I would have been kind of annoyed. I need to be on a bench to equip charms, Joe, you fucking moron. Get rid of this one while we're moving around. Let's give quick slash a go while we're on the trail. Uh, let's see. So we are at Kingdom's Edge, a place I didn't even know existed. While we're here, let's check out the Colosseum of Fools, because that sounds like exactly my kind of place. There was a door in Abyss with the same brand you just picked up. Ancient Basin. Spikes. Uh, really? I don't recall... Mixing up Dark Souls terms. <laughs> no, you have to you have to summon Sif for the Manus fight, and then you can ride him, and then you get to play as Luigi. Oh, back to getting hit by every single enemy attack. We're back on track. Curtsies to my sovereign. Thank you very much. I forgot I don't have the map marker on, so this is going to be terrible, but I'm going to try and find my way there anyway. It's in the middle at the very bottom. It's the deepest lore. I see. That would be that then. Why is there a thwomp in prison in Bowser's Castle in Mario Kart 64? That's deepest lore. Oh, and I don't have my Geo Magnet on. Never mind. We're just climbing up here anyway. Not that I desperately need Geo or anything. Not like I died and lost an undisclosed amount of Geo. I guess that leads to City of Tears that way. Nope! Or maybe this way. Oh, you know what? Forget it. I just want to get to the Colosseum.
Taboo Blue Goo. Nice. It is deepest taboo to consume the blue goo. I will head to that door in the ancient basin as soon as I have checked out the Colosseum. Promise. If I can get there. Oh! Okay. That thwomp did unspeakable things. Warm, tiny thing. You climb high. Seek the knowledge of these lands. This ashen place is grave of worm. Once told it came to die. But what is death for that ancient being? More transformation, methinks. This failed kingdom is product of that being spawned from that event. Interesting. Tiny thing. Oh, mm. the mark of worm you bear. Is it change you seek? Or to save this ruin. That choice is yours. Always the smallest creatures that attempts the largest things. Ooh. Uh -huh. This falling ash is malt. The worm's corpse decaying. Endless. Mm, serene. Sad. With its light gone, the world is smaller. Don't mistake. I am not a worm. Orm... Too small I am. Too many limbs. No foresight like those old things. For quiet retreat did I climb up here, away from spitting creatures. Or, mm, yes, high up. Away from simple minds lost to light. Theirs is a different kind of unity. Rejection of the worm's attempt at order. I resist the light's allure. Union it may offer, but also a mind bereft of thought. To instinct alone, a bug is reduced. Hmm. Uh, oh, no. That patented jab of the heart accent. <laughs> Tuta candula solo. Hmm. Be on your way then. It's rest I'll return to. Though in these times sleep oft proves uneasy. But what if I could hear your thoughts, Jabba? One prefers its- Oh, whoops! One prefers its mind not be pride. Is rather unsettling. Rather invasive. Jeez. That is- I'm sorry, I didn't think about that. That is quite rude. Uh, oh, no. Hang on a minute. Yeah, I feel like a dick now. <laughs> so where is this Colosseum? Where am I? I miss my map marker. I'll leave you alone for just a second. It's hard to tell what's a door and what isn't with all these light sources. Mind tricks don't work on me, only money. Oh, is the is the Colosseum up here? I can't fucking tell where I am. I need a bench. Shit. I get confused so easily. It's sad.
So that's the Coliseum up there. Please! a champion. I won't die here. You kind of died here, mate. Sorry. Jump into the projectiles. That's cool, too. Yep. Do you have as much trouble finding your way IRL? Yes. Okay, it looks like I can't get to the Colosseum from its corpse chute. Maybe this way. I never usually have to find my way. Because, I mean, as I've mentioned previously on stream, I don't ever go anywhere. But, um... If I do have to find my way somewhere new, I've got a handy map on my phone. So yes, without a map I really am useless. And- OH THEY EXPLODE! Ah! <laughs> Oh, bench. Forget it. Patawas Geo. Well, this is fine, because now I can tell I went up a whole different way than I actually thought I did. I was under the assumption that that first column on the... Like, there's two columns on the left there. I thought the right one was the one that led to the Colosseum. So I got really confused when it just led to Jabba the Bug. Honestly, how do people play this game without knowing where they are on the map? Like, that charm is a necessity. Going up the wrong one again, aren't I? And charging into everything along the way, too. Oh my god, where is the. F <laughs> okay. I'm just getting a bit annoyed! We'll just climb up and go that way. It's fine. I have a pretty good sense, uh, a pretty good innate sense of direction, so I'm usually in charge of navigating when I go places with other people on the rare occasion that I do. Yeah, that would be cool. Knowing where you are. It's okay, that's what maps are for. For helping idiots. How do you get to this Colosseum, man? I honestly have no idea.
Oh well. We'll connect one of the corridors up here on the map and then backtrack to the abyss. Keep heading up to the left. Of course, away from the mark on the map. The map betrayed me. And this connects to the City of Tears. Oh, now it all makes sense. This was the empty room that I couldn't figure out why it was an empty room. To the Colosseum! And victory! Oh. Aha! Uh -huh. Another warrior finds their way to our fair Colosseum! Ours is the final destination for all seeking trials of intense and deadly combat. All one has to do is place their mark upon the trial board of choice and lo, the arena's gate will open. There's a small fee attached to each trial, but I'm sure as skilled a combat as yourself will have accrued a wealth of Geo. Now, before you draw your nail and rush eagerly into battle, I'll offer one quick word of advice. There's a warrior's pit just below here, where others like yourself await their own trials. I'd strongly advise using it to rest up before placing your mark. Oh, and have no doubt, I'm a fearsome warrior myself. Don't go judging me by my size or my current, uh, constraint. The Colosseum beckons us both. I'll be back in battle soon. Make a contribution and you can enter the trial of the warrior. Okay. Ooh. Very well then, a, a new trial is open to you. I hope your performance is spectacular. So we want to go and save first. <gasps> Zoot! What are you doing here? Hmm? What do you want, Kerr? Have you come to laugh at me as well? Fools, did you never consider the fact that- oh. Did you never consider that being trapped in this cage was precisely what I intended? Yes, by all means, release me into your arena. <coughs> <coughs> I am Zote the Mighty, and as soon as I draw my nail, Life Ender, your laughter will turn into terror. Leave me be, you lowly worm. I must rest before my great battle. Pray we do not meet in the arena. How miserable to be stuck here instead of continuing my quest. I came to this kingdom to fulfill a promise, and that is what I will do. We've got to help him on his quest. And there he is! Pale one, you found it too then, this perfect place. I'll soon be entering the battle, just taking a moment to rest first. Though few could truly challenge me, I'm hoping this arena presents the sort of brutal challenge I'm after. You think this shell a defensive arm? Well, I'll give you fair warning, it conceals a deadly surprise. Pay you never find out what that is. I'll crush them all. Oh, and you. You'll see me at my deadly best. I'm sure I will. What do you really think? The perfect challenge. I can already taste my victory. Well, he really believes it. I'm sure he's not so bad once you get to know him. Oh shit. <laughs> wow, this is popular. My kind of place. Don't worry, Zo, I'll free you. In the arena. The hell? Is this the corpse shoot? Keep heading right, you'll need it later through here. Chilling in the hot tub. Why does it disturb me? <laughs> Everyone wants private bath time. 
So it's okay, he's just so crusty. He's a bit of a crusty miser, isn't he? I like Zote. I don't like his voice, I really wish I'd done a different one, but it's too late now. Trial of the Warrior. Fight for Geo and a Charm Notch. Place a mark and begin the trial. Yes! Watch as I one-shot this. Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here? Bugs can't look up. Oh, the bounce! No, don't roll down! This is going to be good. Yes, my performance will be spectacular. Oh shit. Ah, no! Oh, not these things. Dear God, I hate these things. Face my challenges? How? Why in the arena, of course! Fuck! Oh, this is even better. My name is Maximus Decimus Aurelius. Husband to a murdered ladybug. Father to a murdered thunderbug. And my grandfather got squished. Oh god. They're not fucking around now. Oh no! Shit!
baby. I'm a bubble bubble kiss by a rose on a brain. Ooh, little baby. Oh, it's not over. Oh no. Oh, end my suffering. I like how your victory song is kissed by a rose. Well, what else would it be? Are we done? Can I go home? Gotta take my heels where I can get them. Exploding. It's never over. Send in all the slaves. Oh god. I can hear my cat trying to get in. They're pounding at the door. Easy, buddy. Oh, please! Oh fuck! No! No, Zotes! <laughs> oh, Zotes. I won't do it. I won't kill him. Don't hit Zoat. I'm not gonna hit Zoat. Oh god. <laughs> this is so sad. Oh, he's so mighty. Let him hit you. Yeah. Zoat. You have bested me. I submit. Oh. Ah. Uh. 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 I am slain. Uh. Oh, I have been oh, bested, please. Mercy. So, please. Have mercy. Oh, such swordsmanship. Oh. Do I, re do I have to kill him, really? I'm not gonna. I'll stand here all night. Oh, 
Well, we'll call it a draw. Come on, so we're breaking out of here. I'm going to bounce you like a battering ram against the door. Okay, that door's not working. Let's try the other one. Oh man, he's dodging that dream nail pretty well. I'll kill a thousand more! Will that be enough, father? Another fool to cut down by life ender. To be cut down by life ender, I'm sorry. <coughs> I really don't want to kill him. Do I have to kill him? Gonna end, is it? There's gotta be a way out of here. Don't worry, a few hits should be okay. Oh no. So I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, so. Gotta be a way to break out of here. Two bugs enter, one bug leaves. No! <laughs> so. <laughs> oh, I knew he was in the fucking arena. Why did I do this? Sorry, Zoat. I think he's still alive, so we're okay. Go on, curse, scurry away, lest I humiliate you further. Okay, he's alive. Uh, he's all right, folks. See you, Zoat. Well, that was an emotional roller coaster. You can hit him more? Why would you do that? What kind of monster? What kind of awful person would do that? <sighs> Man. What a day. Buddy. For grumbly zoat noises. That's just mean.
but I think that's a good place to end today's session. Oh man, I was so afraid. I was so afraid that that was going to have to be a fight to the death. Thank fucking god. It wasn't. Time for level two. <laughs> no, maybe tomorrow. He's still a butt, but now he's a cute butt. Zote always had a cute butt. Was a cute butt! But yeah, uh, thank you for joining me, guys. Uh, I'll be back again tomorrow, same time. Thank you, Zach, for finally joining us. Uh, I hope you can make it again tomorrow. If not, no worries, but good to see you. Good times were had by all. Uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Have a good rest of your evening. Thanks, man. Catch you guys next time. <laughs>